Hey everyone, Slambo here, hopping on another contest. This one is for Miss 80s Movies and Music. She had uh, three questions related to both mu movies and music. And uh, it took me a little bit to figure out what I was going to answer for these, but I've got an answer and let's go through it. So the first question was to show two movies that would make a really great double feature. I went to the gym this morning and I was chatting about this with my trainer and we talked about Mel Brooks films. But ultimately, you know, I, I don't have as many of those as I really want, so I'm going to go with a uh, with another director that I really like, and that's Terry Gilliam. And we'll start with Monty Python and the Holy Grail, and we'll combine that with Time Bandits. So two Terry Gilliam films that are really out there and really good. They both have a nice big adventure to them, and I think they would go well together as a double feature. Second question was to show five records that you absolutely can't live without, Holy Grails, Desert Island Picks, etc. I picked one right away based on that, and that of course is, they might be giants, Flood. This is the album that really put this band on the, on the, uh, on the interface for a lot of people, especially the song Birdhouse in Your Soul, which was on here. That was their big hit. And then I started thinking about other records that I would want to take with me, and you know, I just kept coming back to They Might Be Giants. And I, to keep it simple, I just grabbed all the vinyl that I've got from them. So Nanobots, and we've got Y, and we've got Phone Power, and finally their, their latest album, Book. So those are the five records that I'm going to go with as the ones that I can't live without because I'm always listening to They Might Be Giants somewhere. The third question was to show something with a zero in the title. I took a look through my catalog on Discogs and I didn't see anything with zero or the number zero in the title other than 10,000 Maniacs, and that's not really zero, that's 10,000. So I didn't quite count. Uh, I had to look through the song titles. And I found on Weird Al Yankovic's Polka Party album, the last song on here, Christmas at Ground Zero. So there we go. So there we have it, with contest entry for Miss 80s Movies and Music. We had a double feature of Terry Gilliam films. We had five records from They Might Be Giants that I'm not going to give up at, at any cost. And Christmas at Ground Zero to round out the two, five, and the zero. That's what I've got today. See you next time.